All right, let's go. Okay. All right, hey guys, welcome to the YouTube video. This video will be talking about Barraza. Simple, short, and simple. A guide on Barraza. So how to maximize him, and you know how to you know be good with um him. Now I don't have like much room to say or like much um. What's the word I'm looking for? I can't just say like I'm God or something with them, but if I have to say anything, my Raymond's a level 84 and I primarily used his ax and my gun skills are, I'd say decent nonetheless. So I'm not gonna say he's a good or bad character. If you need any professional examples upon this said character, what you really wanna look at is um Cody. So look up some Cody Travis stuff, but you want to really get your own take and own feel for it. So his main strong suit is his defense, okay? He can take a hit and he's real good with that. He's slow compared. Let's run that back and go to his stats real quick. He is slow if you, oh, let me actually be on him first. So he's slow compared to the other legends and his dexterity isn't that high. And his attack is average or slightly oh, above awesome. average. Now that's not a bad thing. That's actually all right. We can work with these, these um particular, uh what, what's the words I'm looking for? Particular issues or particular things. All right. So first things first. Let, let, I'm pretty sure y'all know all the six, but I mean I can run them down if you really need me to, just in case. I'm not gonna put no time scamp. You could just skip ahead if you already know all his six. But his first six, this right here, his barrel roll pretty nice it, you you see it hits a little bit right there and then boom keeping this nice short and simple this other one this one right here this one um his forward x i don't really know the terminology it kills me i i, I mess it up all the time this actually catch him right so what i like to do with this move though is just doom and then get him with a second hand that's what really you always get this is good for scythe players um lance you, you can see kind of where it hits. So I'll just do that. We see where that is. Let's show the axe real quick. Everybody knows this move. If you played Barraza more than a day, I'm pretty sure you know what this does. And we also got this one. I hate this move with a burning passion, but I can't tell you how many times I've gotten a kill off of it. So, 50-50. Anywho, let's get the let's get these combos started. So I'm not gonna waste time um, going over you know combos on um, axe and all that type of stuff. I'm just gonna give you strictly tips and stuff on what you can do with mans to maximize his sigs and the stuff I've learned, and then I'll go into some like experimentals or might go into a little rank just so you can see me try to not be you know trash with him just so you can see um so we got that right there not a true combo you can see if i rewind her back it's not a true combo but wait for it so hit her and then you see got a whole bunch of dodge windows but sometimes people like to dodge away and that and this now one thing you want to master first off with this dude is hello Hey, bro, I'm on Twitch. Uh, I'm making a Brawlhalla little segue. I'm going to edit this out. But um, so if you want to hop on the Twitch, it's uh, Boss DK, uh 23 man. Just trying something new, trying to see, uh, you know, how it's going to work. But uh, back to what I was saying, guys. So this move is a good and bad move, right? People use it a lot. They spam Sig with it a lot. But the first thing you want to master with this dude is this. It's slide off. I'm good um but the backwards slide off is good too but you gotta really angle it now the inputs and how to do that i can't if you could do this if you can learn how to do this which is i'll explain it real quick you hold the sig while you're going forward right so what you're doing is kind of like this you're using the momentum to charge off and slide off that's like the basics of what i can give to y'all and the most basic thing and then you're just doing the reverse of that which is a little bit harder but not super ooper duper hard hold up 
I'm, I'm, I'm able to do it more in conflict and stuff like I'm fighting somebody. Do, 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 do. I guess I can't do it. I'm looking goofy. But if you can get down the uh, reverse, the reverse uh, upstick charge, that's be beneficial because you'll be able to catch their dodges at a better, better angle or when they're recovering back onto stage, okay? And now this, this sink right here. Listen, look, look, look. You see how he steps back, all right? You see the step back. So that means if a person's walking up on me, I'd normally back up. So I don't need to back up, right? I'll let them come this way and hit them. Or if, once again, the t referring to this, if you can angle it right, which I haven't been able to, this was more of a theory ordeal, but if you can angle it right, you can hit them while they're trying to, you know, while they're still on stage, because I've done it forward and doing it forward doesn't work normally while they're like already like right up in this area where I'm jumping in. But if you can get them while they're out stage, you know, off stage or whatever, boom, you're good, you're chilling. So how do you be good with his ax? is really just more of spacing and timing and baiting. So I would throw out an attack, let them think they have room to punish. So let's say I'm right here and I swing and I hit that, right? Get the bot to move. And the bot like, yeah, thinks she can come in and hit and she does something like this. So after she does some something like that, that's my cue to either hit her with this, hit her with, you know, a neutral X, do something like this, and then try to, try to grab her. It's really just about being patient and trying to find the best opportunity. This move works for gravity cancels and really try to think outside of the box when you're um, playing with mans. Let me make sure no one say anything on my YouTube. Make sure none says. All right. So that's kind of like the premise with them. And you want to try to figure out different little things you can do. And when you're playing with them, since you don't have speed, you need to have good movement. That's really where it uh, makes up for his lack of speed because you're able to move around and he's able to take a couple of hits. So try to use that the couple takes of hits to um, rack up as much damage as you can with your axe. And you know, but if y'all need an axe guide, I can make a video upon that. But I do not plan to make one right now. Um, let's see, what else can I say about his axe? There's not really much to say about man's axe. It's pretty much just not self-explanatory. But it's literally play with it smart as you can and get good and comfortable with his sigs. Like understand the spacing of his sigs and how they work, especially this sig right here. Cause like what I like to do is maybe I'll do, oh, hold up. I got her positioning off. So let me give you an example. So if I'm just doing a light, light reads, light reads, none, none big body. So let's say I did something like this. Well, hold up. I got to get her to dodge just to show y'all the example. So this is what we're going to do here. Do boom, boom. That's something I could do. Wait for them to recover, throw my weapon. Which that I'll probably be able to show that more in game, but yeah, when you you gotta also try to practice um hitting them off stage and then hitting them with this and then the weapon throw into like whatever you can hit them into. It's gonna make more sense if um when I go online and do it, so y'all can actually see it. But now let's talk about his blasters. His blasters, I personally think most people believe his blasters to be his, you know, far better weapon. And I don't blame them because this right here catches people crazily. And this right here always catches someone off guard because of the dick. Look at this range. So, okay, hold on. Let me slow it down so y'all can really see this real quick. So, boom. That, all that's a hitbox. And then if that doesn't get you... He extends his gun out like he's the realest person to exist and just meh, goofy goodbye like like it's beautiful but uh once again i'm not going to talk about weapons or how the weapon itself works i'm just going to talk about optimizing how to play with this particular character so his blasters really up to you on how you want to do this if you want to be aggressive i'd always advise you to be good with position do not try to approach in like this or try to approach. You You want to be very smart with your approach options and what you do. Now, reads, 
can go from let's see we got a neutral read, right so um hold on let me see if that no that doesn't hit i could have sworn that hit oh god muscle memory stop it i could have sworn that hit there we go yeah, yeah. so that's a neutral dodge read. that's cool but the one i'm more interested in are like these types of reads right here that doesn't not is um no 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 which one was it let's see here we do this and then something to that effect this this sig right here can catch a lot of people especially if they're used to playing against a good gun player because let's say i gravity council well i gotta space it right I, oh i know what i need to do so wait no i could i could not hit what i wanted to show but the premise with the down sig or well, is it the down one gotta get these inputs right that particular sig is it's good to catch like let's say they're running away like let's say you hit them with this and they're running away you can immediately throw that out let me use this as an example i'm just giving you all the premise and then as i play a game or two you'll see more of what i'm talking about hopefully if you got any questions put it in the comment down below and if you made it this far into the video i would also like you to put down bomb yeah Nah, but uh, for real, so hit him. Well, I actually, I gotta move around. Though. Boom. So the, the, you want to use this to catch slightly out of your range of where your blasters wouldn't hit. Now, when you use this move, it really depends. It depends what you're trying to hit. Are you trying to hit the whole sig, or are you just trying to hit them with the blast? Because if you're trying to hit them with the whole sig, so let's say I did something like this, right? Oh, well, hold up. I need them to go away. So let's say that. That would be me trying to hit them with the whole sig, because I knew they were going to dodge that way. Or, let's see here. I do something like this. Oh, hold on, we gotta actually do it. Not really like a combo or something optimal, but it's just like, it's really depending on where you're trying to hit it. Once again, I'm not doing anything fancy here. It's all about the spacing with this dude because he's slow. So you have to be moving around, waiting for your time to strike, and then you know you go in for the kill. So let me give you kind of an example here. Where is the settings for this dude? Because we're about to go on the map, and then maybe I could try to explain the blasters a little more. So right there, let me show y'all. This is kind of what I meant when I said you want to catch. I knew she was gonna have to come up so i was like all right let me back step because i know it leans forward and then yeah uh, and then boom i hit her now some of y'all might be like duh but for the people that don't right there same thing applied here even though this is a bot i'm just giving y'all the premise of it so y'all can have an idea of what i'm referring to so look right here oh hold up how far did i go oh i didn't mean to go did i go too far I went too far. Rewind. All right. So right here. I was like, okay. So I believe this person's not ready. So by the time they get even close enough, I'm already hitting them with the sig. So they already get hit. Boom. Now I hit them with the whole sig. Nothing they can do. Or I can space her around a little bit. Wait. Oh well, she hit a perfect dodge on me. So I'm looking goofy, but I can wait it out, outspace it, because most of the time people think they're good when they dodge it, but they always forget about this. Uh, gravity cancel. Um, we okay. So let's say, hold on, let me let her move around freely, take her off her leash. Uh, come on, bro. There we go. All right. So, um. Okay, so if I come on, man, what are you doing? But she's better than this. Oh, it was my fault. I'm looking goofy. Oh, okay. So this is kind of what I want to show you. Like, let's say she's coming at me. I want her to move around this way. I can I can reverse it. Is what I'm really trying to get at is like if you see someone and they dodge through you. It's a good read to turn around with, or the gravity council. The gravity council with this move is very ferocious. That, yeah, I think that is, is not something 
100% optimal, but it is something you can do. Let me show you. And you back to standing. Oh, well, hold up, I dropped it. Bro, hold up, let me let me turn her health down a little bit. Uh, all right. Not that. Oh my God, I'm too close for this combo. No, 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 back up. Boom, boom. Well, what I'm trying to do is hit this gravity cancel. I'm looking unprofessional. I guess, I guess the, the Brahala gods will not allow me. Well, I tried, but the weapon throw into D light, into gravity cancel of your choosing is very beneficial. Um, but the, the optimal one from what I've experienced is um, that one. There you go, that. Because what most people do is they'll just spot dodge. So then I'm like, all right, bet. I hit him with all that, and then I hit him with the um, neutral, or I hit them with the little Siggy Sig. And then that hits most of the time when I'm like, right, because I'm always stacked with them by the time this actually hits. So with enough of all of that being said, if you got any questions, I can, you know, let you know. But let's go into YouTube. I mean, YouTube. Let's go to an Online. actual match. Online and uh try some stuff out Barossa. and there's no guarantee that the person i'm going against will be god tier so uh, let's see hmm. use these guns and Barossa. all right do, do, do. Do, do, do. Elmo's world. Boop, boop, boop. Hmm? Yo, how's it going? Hey, bro, I'm pretty good, dog. Three, um, right two, now I'm just one, on a Twitch bro. live streaming, dog. Kaboski K23. All right, here we go. Yeah. Right there, an example. All I'm right now, I'm just really trying to keep my spacing as much as I can. Even if I don't win, I just want to show y'all the premise. Hold up. No, I can't even say that. That's cat. That's preparing to lose. Cat. I apologize for the cat. Oh, he hit a combo. He said, who said you was going to win? Uh-oh. Weave. Oh. Bro, Brody, calm down. Good, good. Sir. Oh, no. Yeah. All right. Weave. He said weave himself. Damn. Bro, what are you aiming at? Uh oh. I was joking. I was joking. I was playing. Yeah. Stupid. So I saw the weapon throw. What's up, random? <laughs> uh, I saw the weapon throw, and I was like, all right, let me hit them with the stick. It's got good. It's got good coverage, and sometimes it can help you, you know, avoid getting hit with an attack. So don't think it's your sick always as a means of attacking. Not just with him, but with any character. But um, you can use it in multiple ways. Oof. Right there, that's a perfect way of using the sick. Most of the time, people like to jump, so I try to like use the sick and um that upset. Try to use it in a manner that isn't as cliche as what most barrages do. This is gonna take some trial and error, but yeah, you can find a way. I hear you. Right there, I, I didn't even want to do that, but the optimal one would have been this sig. Hate when I don't hit that gravity cancel through. That'd be hurting my soul. Hate guitars. All right, all right, let me this. Let me just get this axe out real quick. Right there, patient, waited. I hit that. Granted, not the greatest play in the world, but apparently not bad either. Let me not say that. Try to keep your combo simple too, with any weapon. Because what most people do is they'll try to go for the, the 
life energy that was. Oh, I knew it. The second I missed that side air. But most people be trying to go for like these big body combos. Just keep it nice and simple. Well, you can always do you know what works for you, but try to keep it nice and simple until you get to where you can do those big body combos. See right there, what I wanted to go for was a slide off. As I said, that second blast always gets them. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. No sir. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Uh -uh. Good sir. Good sir. Calm down. You're getting out of pocket. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh, did I win? No, 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 no. No. Stay away. I didn't mean no harm. Uh-oh. Bro, I'm panicking. <laughs> breathe. Breathe through my nose. Breathe through my nose. <laughs> the choice, man. <laughs> yeah. That was easy. I wasn't scared at once. And we're gonna do one more game. One more game. One more. And then that's gonna be the conclusion of this tutorial. And future me will not be not happy with this whole editing and clipping and cutting of the video. It folded. Ah, it's a Lance. Three, two, one. And no, I do not think Lance is broken for the people that are viewing. It. All right, here we go. He's got high defense. I got high defense, but his weapons are a little bit. His Lance is a little more rewarding uh, for catching reads than my. I want to say every both of my weapons, to be honest. But this sick, it does just Uh-oh, uh-oh. Good, sir. Uh-oh. Oh, no, you don't. Stupid. Think outside the box, kitties. Think outside the box. Oh, he said stupid. I'll show you a box. Fold on YouTube. All right, bro, what are you going for? You're confusing. I'm really trying to bait him out with this like charge sig so he thinks he's got the right spacing and then I come in and fold him. Oh my God! Player one wins. Make the dude rage quit. God, I did him dirty, but I didn't mean dirty, dirty. I thought he was good. I'm not even gonna like flex or anything to y'all. Like I got scared when uh, he pulled up, cause I've been getting folded by those uh by what's his name? What's what's Brody's name? So Roland, so Roland in uh. What's this dude name? Bro, Bravo, bro. I don't even know how to pronounce Brody's name, but him too. Dude's been folding me, but thank y'all for uh, coming to the video and, you know, do the likey like, do the subby subs. Also, if you want to see this when it first came out, you can join me at my streams. It is uh, Twitch, you know, Twitch Live slash the boss. Not the the boss, but just boss DK23. You know, some I don't have a schedule just yet, but we're, we're working on that. I'm just getting there. I just got my first thousand K on YouTube, so I'm just getting somewhere here. So if y'all just bear with the learning process, well, as as I always like to say, and as a homie say, we're getting somewhere. We're getting somewhere. But with that, 